And then there's kind of a more radical uh, philosophy in addition to the contacts, which would be, and I learned this from my teachers, they were, I had, a, I had about five holistic, they were called developmental optometrists when I was in my first years of practice. I, I grew up in the East Coast and so I began my first practice in Philadelphia and I used to go up to Connecticut and there was like five uh, eye doctors and they were in their 70s and they taught me how to prescribe lenses in a way that would help people improve their vision and one of the principles that they taught me, which works very well, is to actually wear the same power of lens in each eye, even if one eye is slightly blurrier. Because when you wear the same lenses, it tells your brain and eyes to start integrating more. It like, it's, like a, it's like a natural vision exercise that says, okay, I'm eight and a quarter in my right, I'm seven and a quarter in the left, so that means my right eye is focusing a little closer than my left eye. It needs more prescription. What if I gave both eyes minus seven and a quarter? Now my right eye has got to kind of match the left eye. And time and time again, when I started to do that, people would come back and say, wow, this feels so much more relaxing. I'm not getting the eye strain. And the other thing about that is because you're at eight and a quarter and seven and a quarter or nine fifty and eight fifty, you're in a natural double vision setup because the right eye is focusing at a closer focal distance than the left eye. You could you could figure that out by holding a target and with each eye separately, you'd probably have to hold uh, the object closer to your right eye to get it clear whereas the left eye would be slightly farther away. So that's already creating an inherent double doubling. So, and then, you know, you're overriding that, but then you get hit like you did, and that kind of creates this, this uh, you know, trauma in the muscles and the eyes. So it's harder for you to kind of muscle it and keep it together and whatever. So my, my proposal my proposal would be in the in the realm of saying well what if what if we got you uh, a, a prescription in contact lenses that would be the same in each eye soft lenses and also the number you know like when it's eight and a quarter in glasses it's going to be a less of a number because it's it's closer to the eye but on top of that one of the techniques that worked really, really well for me, and I, again, use it quite frequently with people that are nearsighted, is I actually have them wear a prescription that corrects them more for computer or reading. So it's a, it's a reduced prescription that still gives them some clarity, but it's not as tight or as strong as the distance prescription. And so, you know, I might think about saying, well, let's do 675, get you a pair of those. You know, you can get, in, in the soft lens world, you can get these disposable contacts and they don't cost very much. And then maybe get you a second prescription that's like in the minus six realm, six in each eye. Now, I would say to start off, the 675s, you're probably not gonna have any problems using those for driving or whatever. But even so, I would just start, say, you know, in your house, you know, in a non-demanding situation, just to get used to, it's gonna be greater vision. You're gonna have a lot more periphery. And this, this balancing between your right eye and left eye, it may take a little bit of adjustment, although my prediction is that you're probably gonna go, wow, this is pretty cool. I can wear the same lens in each eye. And then you could get the minus six. I'll give you the prescription to both. And then with the minus six, you could play with those, say, on the weekend and just wear them um, and just experiment. Just say, hmm, what, what, what am I noticing here? What's, what am I seeing? What am I feeling? What's the double like? And those options would do a couple things for you. First of all, it would get you out of the distortion of what the glasses inherently bring to, to you. Number two, it would start balancing your two eyes. 
And number three, it would give you a technique where you could gently and slowly start reducing your myopia. And that's great for your nervous system and the tension that we carry in the eye muscles. Um, and you might find over time that the minus six actually becomes your distance prescription. If you like this video, hit the subscribe button and turn on your notifications. Please send your comments to me. I'd love to hear from you.